the crew members that are on the ship at various levels, uh, from the lowest level all the way up to the captain, all have varying degrees of responsibilities for different kinds of emergencies or uh, incidents. Uh, at the very lowest level, all crew members have to be trained on, for example, uh, firefighting. Our ships are self-contained cities, and we have very small crews on them. So we have, say, a thousand-foot container ship that has a crew of 22 people on board, including the cooks and the people who are supporting the officers and crew. Out of those 22 people, you have to make a, you have a fire department, you have a police department, you have to address all those things that a normal community would have to have. So some of our officers and some of our sailors make up fire parties or the fire department on board. To do that, they have to go to firefighting school. It's a requirement. They have to be certified at different levels, varying levels of firefighting. Um, because when an emergency happens, we can't pick up the phone and dial 911. We're on our own, 2,000 miles out in the middle of the ocean. Uh, security is the same way. Everyone has a certain basic level of security training and they know what to do if the ship is attacked or if uh, somebody tries to board a ship illegally in a, a port or something. Um, and that goes up from that basic level up to people who would actually respond to the attack, like the captain. So they all have to be trained on not only the the company's um, procedures uh, and policies that apply to these situations, but also how to implement them on board. So we also do drills. In addition to our training, the next level is drills. So once everyone is trained to a certain level, then they actually practice what they've been trained to. And we do fire drills, and we do abandoned ship drills, and we do security or uh, piracy attack drills on board. Uh, man overboard drills. So there are several layers uh, to the training aspect. It's not just learning something, just a knowledge base online. There's also a hands-on uh, component to it and then drilling to make sure you get it right and to get better at it each time.